Memphis targeted by criminals. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kurt Sieglin. And I'm Brittany Miller. Tonight, police at Rutgers University are looking for whoever is stealing students' stuff. News New Jersey's Chris Keating has more on these burglaries tonight. He's live at the Livingston campus. Chris? Brittany, if you're wondering who would be living inside of a Rutgers dormitory in late July, well, students are telling us it's incoming freshmen. Apparently, they've been staying overnight as part of orientation, and some, it seems, have failed to lock their doors at night. Tonight, there was a crowd of parents picking up incoming Rutgers freshmen who spent the night as part of orientation. Many were staying inside the Livingston Apartments Complex, which is well known as the residence hall with the Starbucks and movie theater on the ground floor. These students weren't here on Tuesday, but they all heard about the burglaries. Have you been careful in locking your door? No. I, I, the, the past day, I, I've, I've walked back and my door has just been open. My door and the door from the hallway have both been unlocked, I think. Each student was given a key card to get inside of the building and the keys room, to right, access yeah. individual rooms. Rutgers says multiple rooms were burglarized between the hours of 9 and 12 p.m. on Tuesday. In each case, Rutgers says rooms were vacant and unsecured. Items of value were removed. Rutgers has not yet said how the burglar may have gotten inside, but those on hand for orientation had some idea. I think since there's so many new faces that people are just holding the door for people, so it's like, you know, you don't know who's who. I'm sure that people just like holding the door for other people, and I guess they didn't know if they were a student or not. There are surveillance cameras at every entrance of this building and one on every building on this campus, which should likely help in finding out who exactly did this. Now, as for the suspect in this case, Rutgers officials are saying as of right now, a description is not quite clear. In Piscataway, I'm Chris Keating, News 12 New Jersey.